Hello, we are discussing about GATE 2006 ECE paper and the topic we are discussing is electron devices. This is second one more question came in GATE 2006. The concentration of minority carriers in an extrinsic semiconductor under equilibrium is A. Directly proportional to doping concentration B. Inversely proportional to doping concentration C. Directly proportional to intrinsic concentration D. Inversely proportional to intrinsic concentration Under equilibrium, concentration of minority carriers in extrinsic semiconductor is out of four these options. The correct one is inversely proportional to doping concentration. So the concentration of minority carriers in extrinsic semiconductor under equilibrium is inversely proportional to doping concentration. We will see the details. Minority carriers is going to be calculated by using mass action law in semiconductors. Mass action law states that under thermal equilibrium, the product of the free electron concentration and free hole concentration is equal to a constant and is equal to square of intrinsic carrier concentration. Under thermal equilibrium, the product of free electron concentration and hole concentration. Free electron concentration is indicated with N and free hole concentration is indicated with P is equal to square of intrinsic carrier concentration which is represented with Ni. So, simply by equation, we can represent mass action law for semiconductors as N into P is equal to Ni square. So, based on the type of extrinsic semiconductor, N and P will become, one will become majority carrier, the other will become minority carrier. In case of N type, N will be majority carrier, P will be minority carrier. In case of P type semiconductor, N will be minority carrier, P will be majority carrier. But the rights, right hand side is going to be always Ni square. So, we can tell the same equation in terms of extrinsic semiconductors as the product of minority carrier concentration and majority carrier concentration is always equal to square of intrinsic carrier concentration. So, under equilibrium from mass action law for semiconductors that to extrinsic semiconductors, minority carriers can be written as Ni square by majority carriers. Majority carriers is nothing but doping concentration. Majority carriers directly proportional to doping concentration, whereas generally minority carriers are proportional to temperature. So, Ni square by majority carriers can be written as Ni square by doping concentration. So, concentration of minority carriers from this equation is directly proportional to square of intrinsic carrier concentration and it is inversely proportional to doping concentration. So, from the question, the correct answer is minority carriers are inversely proportional to doping concentration. The right answer for the given question is B. Thank you.